Other local law officers spent the night at Mount Mercy University looking for the next generation of peace officers. Fox 28 News criminal justice reporter Dora yes. Miller is live in Cedar Rapids tonight to tell us about the quarter recruitment effort. Dora. That's right, including last night's shooting, there have been 52 officers that have been killed in the line of duty. That's by gunfire. But there's been a number of investigations into police conduct recently. But tonight, law enforcement made a plea to the students here at Mount Mercy University. And just to say, you know, everything that you see on social media isn't the full story. So dozens of students were able to take notes as eight agencies recapped what they're looking for as far as qualifications are concerned and how each student can get involved. One student we spoke to is about to graduate. He said he's also applied to the Lynn County Sheriff's Office for a job, but he says a lot of work needs to be done. It's just that good people have to be able to do it. Currently, I do see a lot of issues that are happening in America today with law enforcement, but honestly, I feel like a lot of those issues are just put under a microscope. And I feel like if you think about it, there's a lot more crime that's happening today than there is issues with police. Law enforcement is an honorable profession. It's been around for hundreds of years. Uh, we're looking for people that want to help people and, 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 and want to be good to people. Speaking of what Colonel John Stolke just said, the Cedar Rapids Police Department is actually hiring right now. They're accepting applications starting next week, so we'll have that information on how you can get involved on our website. Covering the corridor in Cedar Rapids, Dora Miller, Fox 28 News.